Today we'll be hearing a story from Look, A Child's Guide to Advent and Christmas by Lara O'Leary, illustrated by Anne Boyajian. This is the season of Advent. The church is dressed in blue. The world outside has its own seasons and its own colors. These days, the warm light of autumn is seeping away. All the bright leaves have flown. Winter is coming in black and white. Furry frost coats the bare bones of trees. And by supper time, we can already see the moon milky against the dark sky. In a branch outside my window, squirrels have built a nest. Even the shrubs are snug in their burlap blankets. We are all huddled in the dark, waiting for the light to return. In church, we are waiting too, waiting for Christmas. While we wait, we watch for the light. Long ago, the people of God huddled in the dark, waiting and watching for the light. It was a time of deep sadness. Once they had lived happily in Jerusalem, but an army destroyed their city, their homes, their gardens, their holy places, and carried the people far away across the desert. Everything they knew and loved was gone. All the color and light had seeped out of the world. But in the darkness, God whispered messages of hope. I will bring you home again. Where the ground is dry and cracked, a spring will bubble up. From a dead stump, bright green leaves will grow. On those who sit in deep darkness, light will shine. So even though they could not see the way ahead, the people kept watching for the light. I wonder if it was hard to hope. Maybe they looked back and told stories about how God had been with them in the past. Maybe that helped them wait knowing they were not alone in the dark. During Advent, we look back. We remember people who waited for God, especially in times of trouble. Each character tells a story. Noah and his family waiting for the storm to stop. Abraham and Sarah waiting for a child. The Hebrews in Egypt waiting to be free. Miriam and Moses waiting to see the promised land. The people of Jerusalem waiting to go home again. Sometimes I feel like I am waiting for something. Sometimes I want God to come and help me. Their stories are my story too. During Advent, we practice waiting and watching. We look through old photo albums and watch movies from when I was little. We try to see how God was with us in sad times and happy times. Sometimes we see more clearly when we look back. Every night we ask, where did I see God today? Sometimes I write about it in my journal. Sometimes I paint or draw. Sometimes I use prayer beads. With each bead, I tell God what I hope for. One night, we bundle up and go outside to look at the stars. We remember that God is in the darkness too. Wherever I am, God is with me. Let's think together. Why is it hard to hope? What are you waiting for? What will you do while you are waiting?